ஹரி கிருஷ்ணா வெல்கம் டு தி நெக்ட் ஆஃப் பகவத் கீதா ஆஸ் இட் இஸ் பாய் ஹிஸ் டிவைன் கிரேஸ் ஏ சி பக்தி வேதாந்த் சுவாமி பிரபுபாத்
text numbers 21 and 22 Arjuna uvacha senayor ubhayor madhe ratham sthapaya me achyuta yavadeta nirikshaham yodhu kaman avasthitam kermaya sahayodhavyam asmin rana samudhyame Arjun said O infallible one please draw my chariot between the two armies so that I may see those present here who desire to fight and with whom I must contend in this great trial of arms purport although lord krishna is the supreme personality of godhead out of his causeless mercy he was engaged in the service of his friend he never fails in his affection for his devotees and thus he is addressed herein as infallible as charioteer he had to carry out the orders of arjun and since he did not hesitate to do so he is addressed as infallible although he had accepted the position of a charioteer for his devotee his supreme position is not challenged in all circumstances he is the supreme personality of godhead rishikesh the lord of the total senses the relationship between the lord and his servitor is very sweet and transcendental his servitor is always ready to render service to the lord and similarly the lord is seeking an opportunity to render some service to his devotee he takes greater pleasure in his pure devotee assuming the advantageous position of ordering him than he does in being the giver of orders since he is master everyone is under his orders and no one is above him to order him but when he finds that a pure devotee is ordering him he obtains transcendental pleasure although he is the infallible master under all circumstances as a pure devotee of the lord arjun had no desire to fight with his cousins and brothers but he was forced to come onto the battlefield by the obstinacy of duryodhan who was never agreeable to any peaceful negotiations therefore he was very anxious to see who the leading persons were who were present on the battlefield although there was no question of a peace making endeavor on the battlefield he wanted to see them again and to see how much they were bent upon demanding an unwanted war text number 23 yotsyamanan avekshaham ya etetra samagatah dhartarashtrasya durbuddhe yuddhe priya chikishavah let me see those who have come here to fight wishing to please the evil minded son of dhritarashtra purport it was an open secret that duryodhan wanted to assert the kingdom of the pandavas by evil plans in collaboration with his father dhritarashtra therefore all persons who had joined the side of duryodhan must have been birds of the same feather arjun wanted to see them on the battlefield before the fight was begun just to learn who they were but he had no intention of proposing peace negotiations with them it was also a fact that he wanted to see them to make an estimate of the strength which he had to face although he was quite confident of his victory because krishna was sitting by his side this brings us to the end text number 23 thank you very much hari krishna